Hello everyone, in this video we will see when to use permutation and when to use combination. This is often a confusing thing in exams. Suppose say you have 3 balls and there are 2 slots in which the balls can be put in. So, 3 balls have to be arranged in 2 slots. So, in the first board 3 ways are there. One ball has already gone. So, in the second board, two ways are there. So, 3 into 2 is 6. So, this is represented as 3 P 2, which is nothing but 3 factorial by 3 minus 2, the whole factorial, which is 6. There are 6 ways of doing this. Suppose, say the same 3 balls, you have to choose 2 balls. So, here we use 3 C 2 which is nothing but 3 factorial, 3 minus 1, the whole factorial divided by 2 factorial, which is 3. So, what is the difference here? So, in permutation, order matters. It matters whether you pick up, put the blue ball in the slot first or green ball in the slot first or any, any of it like that. Order matters, but in combination, order does not matter. Either you pick up blue ball first and green ball second or green ball first and blue ball second, both are one and the same. So, there is only one way. Similarly, there are only three ways. But whereas in permutation, whether you put blue in the first slot or green in the first slot, it matters. So, arrangement matters, order matters in permutation. So, this is the key to solve which is permutation and which is combination. Thank you guys for watching the video. Please subscribe our channel to continue watching more videos. Thank you guys.